Hey everybody, it's BC here, and welcome to another episode of Void Train. And I have been busy since the last episode. I decided to do some stuff off camera. Uh, one of the things I'm actually going to show you pretty quick. I'm probably show you right now. Uh, I have done a little bit of work in the armory. Uh, I'll show you in a minute here. Uh, I have re done a little bit of rearranging on the train. As you can see, I've made a little bit of room here. I moved uh, workbenches onto this side, the labs onto this side. I moved the crusher to the back here, and same with the smelters. And this is just to get a little bit more room and move, maybe a little bit more organization. Uh, I have been trying to upgrade all these chests up to tier 2 and got about that far. Uh, the armory I have gone through and I have gotten rid of all the basic components I had. So now we just got the, the greens and the blues of whatever we have. I have worked on the guns too. I have... Oh, big enough. That's the wrong gun. There we go. I have done a little bit of upgrades on... Like, Alright, what I'm doing there is I actually have side buttons on my mouse and I keep hitting them. That's why that's happening. But, I have done a little bit of upgrades on these. Where'd he go? Where is he? Uh, yeah, I went through all the components that I had, see what I could do to replace things, and I got about 25% out of everything. Uh, is he not going to be around? Probably not. Anyway, uh, yeah, so I have done some rearranging around here, tried to get a little more organized, and uh, space concerns. Uh, like I said, I moved the crush over here. I've got the smelts over here. The chests are going to be for the scrap and for the time being uh, wood. Uh, coal's going to be on this side, same with the ice. Probably get rid of this because I don't really need that. And then I've been thinking about uh, Reflimo and Reflimo. First of all, we should rename them. Where is he? Okay. Come here. Oh, of course you take off. Alright, well, let's pick you up. We're actually going to rename you guys. So I don't get them confused. Okay, we're going to make you. You were... We'll name you... Like. We'll do the old classic YouTuber thing here. Okay, we'll name you... We'll name you Like. And then you, of course. We're going to rename... Subscribe. And there we go. So now, release you. I do here. You. Okay, yeah, I gotta... I might have to disable those, I think. I don't really need them for this game. Where is he? But yeah, the, the DPS on this is apparently uh, 145, which is about the best I've gotten out of all three weapons. This was originally 29, I think, on the damage. And then replacing, I believe it was the the frame that got me more damage on it. I did lose a little bit of stability. That's fine. Oh. Okay. Where was he? Was that you? I have no idea. Anyway, back to these guys. Um, one of them, and I believe it was like... Oh, you're back. Of course you are. Goes down pretty quick now. Definitely noticed the difference. Uh, what I did do is uh, at the last depot there, I went and cleared out the little area with the... The, the enemies are and that went a little bit better I am working on my aim trust me I'm not as bad as you think I, I used to be or so I think I am but we are doing okay um, we should also be picking up uh, the throwing stars thing here I haven't been able to actually find them and I think it's gonna be one of those things where as soon as you see the fireflies and everybody's gonna say hey well we got a recipe for that I have checked in here and I have not actually seen it it would should be under consumables, but I don't see that. It's not under tools or anything like that. I do have the winch because I can do that. It doesn't actually do me anything. It just helps me connect to the, the rings, but I got to make the rings. Um, but yeah, it was uh, before I was rudely interrupted. We'll pick up a like here. Now, like, like just uh, basic, uh, what is it? Uh, gives me extra food if he's cooking or reduces damage on the actual. Uh, workstation he's actually working at so he's not really much of a use to me 
So I'm going to get him in the gathering station. I'm going to use uh, subscribe here, and he's going to be working on the smelters or the lab or whatever I'm working on. I'm just going to make sure to assign him every time. Uh, oh, yeah, on this side here. Oh, that's wrong button. I've got to hold E. Why, I, why is E not working? Worker not assigned. I have no idea. I guess I have to hit the blackboard. Uh, okay, let's see. We'll use like. Uh, oh, there we go. So he's going to be doing that, and then uh, subscribe is going to be helping me with everything else. And we are going to continue on. I'm going to gather resources. Uh, I have done a little bit of research. Oh, that was you. Uh, done a little bit of research since. I uh, did the acid collecting before we I left, and that's just so we can actually pick it up in this area. And same with the sturdy leather. I might actually go ahead and start working on towards this, and I might actually get the materials to make it. And that's just so I can get a bigger inventory space. And I'm going to need two sturdy leather, two steel bolts, and two brass wire. And I think I can do bolts and the brass wire. I think I can actually do everything. Uh, sturdy leather was, I believe, just thickener and leather. Yeah, one leather, one thickener. So let me get that together, and then uh, I'll do some gathering of some resources, and I'll bring you back when I find something of interest, or a storyline, or another guppy to kill. Well, look at that. He's giving me a hand. These guys are great. A lot better than what they were before. They used to just sit on a pedestal all day and, you know, wait for their mushrooms. Or do that. Okay, I got everything ready, so let's go ahead and research... Oh. Did I not pick it up? No, I didn't. No. No inventory space. No, I did. I don't know what I ate, but made room. Alright, so we do that. And then after this, I think there was, uh, what was the other one there? Uh, hmm, blueprint. Or, uh, rubber, sorry. So I actually need to find acid for this. I don't actually know where that comes from. Uh, I've been hearing talks about bugs. I've been seeing pictures about bugs. Uh, kind of glad I upgraded my weapon. Uh, anyway, uh, so let's go ahead and see what we need for that. That would going to be, yeah, it's going to be in here. What do we need for that? Four sturdy leather, two steel bolts, two brass wire. Uh, yeah, I'll work on that and I'll uh, bring you back when something comes up. Okay, after some serious micro crafting, I finally have the the suit. So uh, let's go ahead and. Do that. Oh, okay. That's what it does. It doesn't actually, it doesn't actually increase my inventory size. It increases armor plating size. No, I don't get the armor plating back, unfortunately. But that is fine. I think I have one here. Yes. And then as you can see, there's a second slot there. So a little bit more, but it doesn't really matter. Uh, I haven't had too many issues except for the guys with the shotguns. Uh, they got a little bit of fire rate on those things. Uh, Anyway, uh, I think we're going to be there fairly soon, so I'm going to keep going and gathering what I can. We've hit this fog again, and I have a feeling this might be it. it might be in here that we get the event. But anyways, uh, I'll bring you back when we get there. The lag spikes. They are true. We have reached our destination. Fireflies ahead. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's about three or four leg spikes in the last five minutes. I had a feeling we were getting close, and uh, I haven't gotten close enough to actually trigger anything, so I wanted to pause the recording, uh, get the recording started just before that. I have gathered up a few supplies. I have gotten some plating ready. Um, other than that, I haven't really done too much except for trying to get some crafting done. Uh, as far as the bugs go, I have a feeling I have to get them from the arenas to get the acid. Uh, I'm was reminded of the, uh, the arenas by looking up the patch notes for the, the most recent update. I just wanted to see if they actually made any changes. It's just a simple uh, hotfix for bugs and minor little things. So it wasn't any, any game changers. But anyways, uh, I do have some iron on me. I made some food. Uh, let's actually go ahead and put another one of those on. Uh, we'll eat that. Not that it really matters. And uh, get some more iron, iron smelting. Because, you know, that's something that's always got to be going on. Don't really need to hire a uh, subscriber to that because, you know, it, it decreases the time. It doesn't really matter because I'm out at the, out the front of the train most of the time. Anyways, I'll grab this and then we'll head on in and see what this recipe is. I think it's just basically iron. 
it's like a little consumable throwing ring that we get and then any one of these boulders that has a crack in it like that one right there we can throw a throwing ring in and spider-man our way through get rid of that wait for it wait for it There is a little slow today. There we go. In the come on, come on. Sometimes you just have to follow the light. It will always show you the right way. Oh, did you stop me? Stop it for me? I guess you did. All right. So follow the fireflies. Now I can't actually craft any craft them yet. I don't think I actually have to get the recipe for it. Well, let's see if it's unlocked anyways. Consumables. No, it's not. No, unless it's in Workbench 2. Uh, no consumables. Okay. Well, let me uh, pick up that. And that. Now, I, I think the first time I went to this island, uh, I believe it was in a different... It was definitely a different biome. I believe it was, like, really dark, so I couldn't really see too much. And from what I remember, it's really foggy, and you gotta sort of make your way through. There are certain areas you can throw the hooks on, some certain areas you can't. So we'll figure that out as we go. Anyway, uh, let's clear out my inventory before we go. Uh, I have a feeling I know what's to expect. I don't know if they actually changed anything. Uh, chances are they might not have you know the puzzle idea was good there was different variations maybe they've changed a few things about it but uh let's just do this and scrap in there um iron in there and i guess i'll just, uh, actually we'll get that cooking and zinc surprisingly i should know where things go haha <laughs> Anyway, uh, go ahead and cook some grilled organics. I found the void with fat. I found the void. What could possibly go wrong? Okay. There we go. The, the floating potatoes there. I have a vague feeling we've overlooked some things. Like yeah. the winch brackets. Oh, yeah. I can actually take an item from the ghost. No, I don't remember this. Uh, throwing rings, yada 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 yada. Okay. They are consumable, and I hold Q to change that, and I did get 20 of them. Now, I want to see if they actually. I want to see if it actually gives me the recipe, because uh, I kind of ran out one time. I couldn't make my way back. I honestly don't remember how I managed to do it. There we go. Iron bar. And I get a pack of 10. Alright, well, let's uh, craft up another 30 of them. That should be good enough. You never know, I might get lost following a set path. It's happened before. Okay, we'll make 15 of those. Uh, put that in there. Uh, like, subscribe, watch the train for me. If I don't come back, don't steal anything. You can sell it, but don't steal it. And. Okay, there we go. So now, now, I can't remember if I can actually reach this one from here. Yeah, because I know these ones you don't actually need the, the ring on, but... I guess I can tether right here, actually. So, bring up the menu, change over to here, and... Then you just hold right click and throw. I can tether onto that, and that gives me a little bit of playroom. Then I can hook on to there and make my way through. Now, where do I get this? And that's the thing is it actually tethers me here. So this is how we go. Anyway, uh, I'm going to make my way through the void and I'll meet you in a movie finder destination. Okay, I think that's a slight change. I can't remember if that was how it was before. But apparently you can put it on any, any of these rocks now. So I can just put it down on this one even though it doesn't have to crack on it. So it goes there and I connect to it. Alright, so, uh, I'm still following the fireflies, and I'll meet you when I get there. Do you see anyone? A scientist, a soldier, any leads? Yeah, that wasn't, I didn't actually take very long, as soon as I stopped recording, that was it. You were here. 
All right, so uh, I should give me a marker to explore. I heard there oh. used to be pesty seeresses living here. I mean, very wise and perceptive, mighty witches. According to an old legend, they were so bored here that they tortured every random guest with their puzzles. The person who solved the puzzle would be rewarded. Hmm. Sounds interesting. All right, well, let's uh, look around. Now we can get supplies and stuff like that. It doesn't look like they really changed too much. Uh, there's going to be a puzzle up here somewhere. I've just got to... Oh. That was the wrong button, of course. Alright, so now how do I get up there? Oh, what is that? Hearing something. Hearing something I've never heard before. Are these things? Oh! Hello. Oh, there's my acid. That's a dangerous creature for sure. Better not get any closer. Yeah, thanks for uh, warning me. Uh, that's new. So how long does that stay there for? Oh, there's a puzzle over there. All right, not very long. Uh, it doesn't look like I can actually collect that. All right. Well, anyway, uh, back to exploring we go. Go over here and uh, let's have a look. I want to actually see what's up top there. I'm actually glad I made 30 more of these rings. See if you got anything hiding. Doesn't look like it. Oh, I didn't make that. Oh, I did. Yeah, that's a uh, mouse wheel. It's set on mouse wheel to do it. Oh, it's one of those ones. Okay. Yeah, this one basically got a bounce of beam around. Okay, there's nothing up here. Uh, am I tethered on here? Yes, I am. Oh. Where are you? Ah. Not the right weapon for the job. Oh wow, that actually wears me on my, my armor. Anyway, uh, let's see what we have in here. A lot of scrap, which is good. Scrap is always good. Look onto that potato there. And. Sorry, I'm looking around. Scrap's always a big issue. Okay, so there's the main puzzle there. Uh, let me explore these two little houses here and then I'll bring you back and we'll go look at that puzzle. Alright, there's a bit of a cutscene here. Is that what the supposed the scientist doing here? There's actually two puzzles here. No. What I remember, there was only one before. Uh, one of those uh, pufferfish guys kind of got me off guard again. Uh, okay, I thought that was scrap. Let's go. I uh, guess it doesn't really matter which one we go to first. We'll go over to this one. Why not? Oh. Hey. Uh, I've missed that so many times. Okay, we'll use that. Gotta pay attention to these guys. Yeah, this one I actually have to look around the houses for this one. I think it's actually in this one here. Let's have a look. I remember there was like symbols on one of the, the roofs or or something. I just gotta line up the, the pattern on that. And then there's that one there. Which we have to bounce things around. Hmm. Let me look around a bit and I'll see if we can find the, uh, the symbols. Alright, there's one of them down there. So we have a fish. Now I have no idea if there's what order these have to be in. If there's any order that do have to be in, I gotta watch out for these 
pufferfish guys, because, you know, they're not going to give me an easy time. So that's what we got to do, is i got to look around for these. So we saw a fish, let me look around see if we can find the rest of them, and then we'll see if we can unlock this. Okay, there's another one on the same island, it's a crab. Okay, I found it, you really had to explore to figure this one out. Came out here, oh, where is it? Okay, there's the other two there. So it's fish, fish, octopus, and crab. That is the code for this one. Let's tether up to this one here. Yeah, I ended up going to all the other islands, more or less, trying to figure, find these things. And it's like, well, I found them on this one, and I was like looking around the backside here and going over there. And yeah, I found them, and I thought, well, maybe I'll go over this way, because I sort of saw the octopus or the squid there. So, all right, so we go fish, the fish, octopus. Come on. And crab. It was harder than I thought. The old witches really didn't have anything better to do. But the legend was right about the reward. Well, we'll see about that reward. Uh, yes, transporting cargo. This is what the backpack's for. And this, is, if you didn't know, is where the altars, what the altar tables are for. Oh, move to the train. Oh, I love that. Because when you found more, one of, more than one of those things, you had to carry that thing all the way back by yourself. Then come back and get the other one. Oh, they actually made a use for Riflimos. That is awesome. Okay, well, let's go have a look at the other puzzle here. I do have to watch out for these puffer fish because I don't have any armor on me. And the problem is, though, you don't see them either because they're blended in with this, this red grass. Okay, so now we go over. Uh, let's put, put one over here. Oh my god, I got 14 of these left. <laughs> I told you we'd go through pretty quick. So now this one is basically. Um, I gotta. I believe I have to aim. Try to get beams in all these three, I think. And it lights up this totem. From what I remember. It has been a while, but fortunately it didn't change too much. Where are you? I see you up there. Uh, I got 11 rounds. Uh, of course. And I bet you anything, that's where, that's where I have to gather the acid by killing him. Uh, now I have to wait for that stupid acid to move. Anyway, uh, so yeah, uh, this one here... Go up here. Make sure I'm recording. Tether onto that, and then I believe. Oh, yes. So now I just gotta aim this down. I gotta try to. Oh, this is when I can actually maneuver, so this is gonna be interesting. So we're gonna do that. And that's gonna send the beam down here. Then this one. Tether to that. Go, on, go ahead and rotate this one. Okay, this one's got two eyes. Now, basically, what I'm trying to do, I'm trying to light everything up. So if I go a little bit, like that, that sets up that beam over there. Oh, that's the wrong button. And that was the wrong button again. There we go. We'll get there eventually. Might be a bumpy ride, but we'll get there. Okay, now this, I believe... Yeah, this one has to go... Where does this one go? This one I can't move up or down, it's just left or right. Hmm. Missing something on this one. I'm gonna go so far. Maybe I'll just have to do with this. Okay, where can I tether? Let's tether down there. Oh, I have this one too. What can I do with this? Besides getting blown up by the pufferfish, where is he? 
I'm really starting to hate those things. There you are. Alright, uh, let's actually do a full clip on this. I thought you gave me acid. You didn't. Oh well. Go away. I hope I'm not actually in it. Okay, good. Alright, so this one here. Okay. Like that. Okay, this is starting to get complex. Okay, now go here. And. That's going to be that one there. Or I could do that one. Not a hundred percent sure where we're going with this. You, you need to get a something from somewhere. I believe it had something to do with in here. Um, there's somewhere I can tether. That's something I can take. No. There we go. Because I think I saw. Aha! The totem up here. Now what is going on with you? Yeah, you're not lining up with something. Hmm. I got that one too. Let me work on this and I'll uh, see if we can figure this out. Hello. I don't think I've seen you before. You're a big boy. I think that's what I've been seeing off in the distance. Not as terrifying, but... Still pretty big. Anyway, back to this. Okay, I almost got it. Uh, I had to go zigzag to the house a little bit, take out some boards and whatnot. But I believe uh, this should be it. Now if we just go ahead and move that over there. And voila, a second chest. And this one, uh, we'll just get someone to pick it up for us. Thank you. All right, now all I have to do is pick up those near the train. I don't think there's anything else left around here for me, except for maybe some resources on the way back. And the usual. Anyway, I shall meet you back at the train, and then uh, we'll start heading back to the depot. And see what goodies we can find inside. I know we can find seeds, but there might be might be some other little stuff. Anyway, I will return. Okay, here we are. Let's go ahead and retail it back to the train. We pick up uh, this chest. And place in heavy, heavy objects, yada yada yada. I've seen that already. Hit X, and we go ahead and place it down uh, there. Always oh, sleeping on the job. Go ahead and grab that one, and we do the same. Uh, place. Alright, so then let's go with us to uh, the depot, and we unlock them there. Hey, I found a piece of coal. Sweet. Anyway, uh, I shall continue on, and I'll meet you when we get there, or find something else interesting. Okay, so, so I came across another outpost. This one's a little different than the other ones I've, we've run across. Uh, I'm gonna, of course, pick up the tokens. I'm only going to pick up the blue items. I'm not going to worry about the white. Well, I'm going to take the green. Uh, just, you know, common, uncommon. Ooh. A couple of weapons here, too. Ooh. Really? Hmm. I'm going to have to check these things out. Uh, let's get some, invent let's get some uh, inventory space. Uh, fairly simple stuff. Uh, it was actually fairly easy to deal with those guys. I was sort of camping out about... Half a click back there, just pegging them off as I could. Uh, used up all the ammo for the fast mantis here, so I'll probably have to craft some up if I can. Um, yeah, let's get some inventory space here. Alright, uh, I'm going to try to keep a couple of these chests open strictly for weapons. In fact, let's do that now. Uh, that way I don't have to keep, leave them on the table, and then uh, every time I go, to, I go to a depot, I will unload all the ones that I don't want, or I have doubles of, or... No, let's, uh, if I get around to actually doing it. You know, inventory management is fun, to say the least. Depending on the situation, of course. Okay, we, um, pick up that. We'll throw the iron in the box here. Now, I don't know if this is going to be, like, anything 
different than what it normally is, but uh, we shall see. All right. I should have enough space now. Let's go see what we can find. Go do some looting. Big of looting. Take that. That was nothing, and I don't know what that was. Take that. Oh. What did I pick up there? Stable blindness. Uh, oh, wow. I'm getting so many weapons. Uh, hmm. Um, 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 um. Okay, what does this actually do? Uh, it's not terrible. Uh, let me do this off camera. I'll bring it back and let you know if I found anything good or not. So, it appears, appears we have run across something. Let's go investigate and see if there's anything good to loot on there. Probably not, but always worth a shot. And, yeah. Go on. There we go. Alright, now you want to tether to this. And let's see what we have in here. More stuff. Uh, more stuff. I have ne not actually figured out where I get the acid from yet. I'm sure I will find it eventually. Uh, there we go. Tether to that. That wasn't really all that much in here, was there? No, not really. I don't think there's any crates or anything around. I guess not, so... Yeah. Uh, nothing much. A little change of, a little change of scenery. Anyway, I have not seen anything yet, so I will bring you back when I do. We have arrived at the depot. Uh, nothing too much really uh, talk about. Sorry, I was uh, thought I saw some scrap of zinc. And I didn't really run across too much. Came across uh, a minefield and uh, did find some more fireflies, but I just chose not to go th go after them because, well, I didn't have the iron for the rings. And uh, well, we got two chests already. We gotta open up. So here we are. Uh, oh. One of them, I think it was uh, like was over there mining on a rock. Uh, I did start craft some ammo, so we're all good to go on the, the firepower. I do have to deal with these guys here, because we have to get to that altar. So we can open up these chests and see what kind of goodies we get. Hopefully it's going to be something good. I do not know. Kind of makes me wonder where, they're, where they went with the artifacts, because that was something that was, was just getting into last time I was playing. Do we get a cutscene, or narration, or we're just getting right into the, the violence? I'm gonna say the violence. Well, your ill-conceived love of using a hammer for everything, but this time, you better not take any unnecessary risks. After all, it's an ancient chest. So in other words, I have to go deal with these guys. All right, well, I'm going to make short, short work of them. Hopefully I survive, and I'll see you when I'm done. Okay, I'm back. Uh, the music is still going, but for some reason, they're all dead. But anyway, uh, I didn't really find too much. I did, however, uh, did find a gun, but I threw it out. Uh, I got a, a, a McCullough Rare Barrel. Which seems to be pretty good, and I got a rare clip as well. You don't find too much else. Uh, as far as tokens go, let's uh, cash in our tokens, see what we can get uh, over the machine here. We got another 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 bit of flimo here. We might swap them out. We'll see how it all works out. Grab whatever loot I can. As, uh, you never know, we might actually be able to upgrade something today, but I highly doubt it. Okay, I have seven tokens. Let's see what we get. Void plants. Cool. I have no idea what they do. Scrap. Ooh, I four iron bars. Not bad. Camels. And more iron. Which is actually pretty good. Oh. Oh hey. Another mod. Which yeah, I think I've got, got about eight of them like that. Wood, and no more tokens. Okay, pick up this. Uh, whatever ammo I can get out of here. And let's see what we have for exchange. Wow, we got a lot of stuff today. 
Even even a freebie, all right. All right, so buy coal chunks. We can buy grease. Okay, so we can actually buy other things too. Oh, look at that. A forcer, which is a piston. Hmm. Interesting. I haven't figured out anything about the, the acid yet. I Like I said, I have a feeling it might be the bugs. I'm not 100% sure. But what we can do in the meantime is... Uh oh, hey, there's actually two of these bins here. Weird. I put all the stuff in the other one and puts it in here. So like, this is all the stuff I'm getting rid of. i got to get rid of this gun. I have a, found a rare one of these, or a green one. And we'll keep that. But anyways, let's go see what these chests are all about. All right, let's... Uh Take this one first. Okay, so we... Now we gotta go over here. It's gonna take a long time because I can't run with this. Which... It doesn't look that heavy, so it really shouldn't be that awkward. And of course, we have to go all the way to the back. We'll get there eventually. It's a bit of a hike. Oh, I missed a mod here. Oh, I actually missed this one. Let's see if I can pick that up. Yes. What did I pick up? Oh, another barrel. Cool. Alright. Almost there. I wonder if I can get uh, like or subscribe to do this for me. Why am I doing all the hard work here? I'm just a train engineer, right? Okay. Now. If it blows up now, it wasn't my idea. Okay, and remember it was my idea. Sure. All right, we got more avoid plant seeds. I don't exactly know what to do. So yeah, that's uh oh, that's even better. I like that. Good idea. Oh, we didn't get too much. Oh. Ooh, who gets the mushroom? Very good question. Hmm. Well, I think it might be subscribed because, uh, there's more for us. Okay, well, I shall meet you back at the train and we'll check it out. Okay, here we are. So now, where are the little two, little two troublemakers? Uh, actually, I want to see what this guy was up first. You might actually be a little bit better. Put you in there. Hit the button. I said hit the button. Which kind of sparked kind of funny. And I hope I don't create like a mutant or flea mode one of these days. Ooh. Speaking of mutants. Oh my god. He's like carbon fiber. Huh. Metallurgist. Uh, crafting time. And crafting, yeah. So he's similar to subscribe. Alright, now where are my little buggers? Uh, where are they? There you are. Pick you up. There you go. Now let's give him let's give him a mushroom. New decor. Hey, cool. We can actually... Oh, so that's how you get unlocked stuff. Okay, interesting. Uh, locomotive handles. Sweet. Alright, now is this... Is this in here? Or is this going to be like an actual... Thing of bobber here. Let's find out. Hmm. Not showing it. Hmm. Let me look into this. 
Okay, I did figure it out. Uh, I actually had to do it in the depot over there, and uh, I'll show you in just a sec. I also looked into the, the train armor, and the train armor, uh, apparently I have to find the, get the exterior walls, which I have to feed these guys mushrooms to unlock. Anyway, so if I go in here, uh, let's go to, go to the last car first, and we'll start it here. So I'll just click the button here, and it's not showing up. Why? Should be showing up in that one. I guess it's not going to work on there. Uh, but I can do it on this one. Should be able to. Why not? It's working over here. Yeah, okay, work on this one. But I don't know why it doesn't want to work on this one. Oh, maybe because I have things too close to the, the walls. Or the edge of the track. Or the platform. Maybe that's it. Uh, let's go ahead and build them there. I think that's what it is. It got too close. I go over here, and then I have a little decorative railing, which I can still jump over. And I think that might be why. I don't think so. We'll try that again. Maybe it just doesn't want to work on the, the second one. Maybe it only works on the, the main locomotive. It's not even showing up in here. Hmm. Same here, it doesn't show. Eh, maybe it's something just for that one. I do not know, but uh, while we're at it, let's put some more on. Because these guys need the core to be happy. Alright, well, let's see how your happiness is. Uh, I believe it was you. Uh, perks. 40% happiness, no decor. Well, you're just being picky. Uh, with, but I think, uh, oh yeah, I do want to check one more thing before we end this one. Okay, so I did look into the acid, and the acid is something I have to get from the arenas. Now, I don't know where the arenas are. I think it might be similar to, like, uh, that last outpost that we saw. It's a different kind of island, but, uh, yeah, I think it was basically you got to survive waves of bugs. Uh, apparently don't get too many of them, so I don't know how well it's going to work, but we'll figure that out as we go. But anyways, I think with that, I will thank you all so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed if you did. Don't forget to leave me a like. As always, I will see you in the next one. Later. Where did those two go? Oh, hey, I was making gunpowder.